Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Look, it's not raining. Look, there's no rain in the sky. Oh, there's a rainbow over there, can you see that? Hopefully, not that we had a bad week last week, but hopefully a lot of the stalls will be open this week. Because the rain just wouldn't hold off last week, people just wouldn't set up their stalls. Which is always a bit of a pain. But hey ho. A bit closer to the entrance today. I think they haven't stuck me right over in the corner. <laughs> you alright? Got any goodies? Yeah. What you got? What you got? But you want to make sure you come back and see me again like Yeah. Because, uh, have a look in there. Ooh. What have we got here? Oh, yeah, I'll have that one. We've got a normal one. How much do you want for all of them? Um, okay, uh, about 30 on that. Yeah. Minimum. Get on the time. 40 on that, really. Yeah. 20 each. Um, yeah, it's probably a bit dear for me that. You have mind on that. Um, I'll tell you what, I'll leave that because there ain't much left in it. Uh, 40 on that one with no controllers. Yeah. And I'll give you 40 for the lot there. Um, I could go 50 at the most on all of it. Well, I'll give you a tenner each on the PS2s and 20 on the. I know, I get I've got. <laughs> Amazing day long. Um, I'll do you 60. What about 55? Yeah? Because <laughs> you know I'll probably come back and spend oh, some more money. <laughs> I'll, I'll try not to spend all my money at the first stall. On them two. Uh, ten on them. I know they're nine for nine. That's a bit comfy, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, go on then. Since as I beat you up on the other stuff. Oh, <laughs> you alright? How are we doing? Yeah, I'm alright, you? Uh, yeah, literally, literally go to him and spend all my money straight up. <laughs> yeah, straight up. Why not? I don't know. Yeah, as well. Free compatible PS3s. Yeah. yeah, and a, um, I can't remember if it was a Toshiba or a Panasonic. Yeah, yeah it's a Panasonic one. Yeah, and then a couple of. That's what you need, yeah, a nice few bits. Yeah. Regular contact. Exactly. Have a good one. See ya. Much got on that. Do it for five? Do it for eight. Seven? Eight. Yeah, go on, I'll take it for eight. Wow, look at that rainbow. I don't know if you can see it. Double rainbow. Much got on your shoes here. Fiver. Done for four. I'll stick at fiver. Um, come back at one o'clock, then. If I haven't sold them, you can four. <laughs> there you go, mate. 
Top, thank you. Much appreciated. <laughs> How much on these, please? Yeah. What's got in your remote? Box here, mate. You know. <laughs> I'd prefer it if the batteries weren't in it. What have you got on your remote? Do it for 10? No. Yeah, go on then. They're rare. Yeah, How much are trainers? Uh, that's a new pair, tenner for the bands. A size 9. How much are the used ones? Technically, I don't think they are used. <laughs> yeah, those ones haven't. No. Um, Did you want all of them or just the one pair? Um, what brand are these ones? <coughs> I'd be interested in these three. The 15? No, because I can sell them on eBay for more than tenner anyway. Um, 18. Yeah, go on then, I'll take yeah. 18 on all of them. What's the same both sides of it? No. I don't know, is it? Do you think they come? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. How much was that? 15. Do it for 10? 12.50. Do it for 12? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we get there in the end, don't we? Oh, yeah, I hate 50s. We've got to charge in the corner. We should charge it to me in a minute, though, so we can let it at the same time. Oh. How much do you want for that? Five amount. Oh, it? there you go. Is that you, then? Yes, it is, mate. Oh, where did you find that? <laughs> where was that? In the pocket. <laughs> Did you want me to find something else in that pocket? <laughs> <laughs> How much is your car? That pipe. Much your trainers? He doesn't know. Three quid? Let's check this one. Yeah, go on then, I'll take them for that. Thank you. That's right, isn't it? Cheers. Quid, yeah, yeah, that's it. Thank you. How much got in your video machine here? £3. Yeah, go on, I'll take that. Right, I'm just going to briefly pause the video here. This remote was there when I bought the, the player, but somehow I've lost it. If anybody sees this video um, and found that remote, can you get in contact with me via YouTube or something? Let me know, because I really want that remote back. Thank you. How much you got for these, mate? Dean. Right. Cheeky offer. Just understand if you say no. I've got nine quid left on me, that's it. <laughs> yeah. Thanks. <laughs> Cheers, thanks for that. Oh, look at that, and I bet they're a little Crusoe as well. <laughs> no, they're not. That makes me feel better. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I literally ran out of money. I didn't even get the whole field. <laughs> yeah, I think I spent 140 quid before I could finish the way around. <laughs> See you later. Run out of money. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, I tried to save some money and I got literally to two aisles to the end. And I was like, look, I was like, oh, I've got like 30 odd quid. And I was like, oh, f I've got nine pound left. <laughs> oh, I'll catch you later. See ya. Oh, back to the iced coffee. Oh, that's some good iced coffee. Um, I can't connect to my phone for some reason. My GoPro Wi-Fi seems to have gone So, yeah. Let's run through what we got. Right, start off with a nice simple thing. It did have a remote. I may well have, uh, uh, no, I may have lost the remote while walking around, which is a pain in the ass. But yeah, Sony video player, 
pay three pound should be between 30 and 40 um, video players seem to have just tanked for me I don't know if it's for anyone else or just me but yeah hopefully I've not lost the remote because the remote was what I wanted it uh, right got a nice jacket here uh, sterling jacket it's like a business jacket not really too sure on the value paid five pounds I'd probably expect around about 30 to 40 uh, it's quite a nice buy um, it's a, uh, a crafts helmet and it's the RX1 Cobra there's a little bit of crack in there but it's not bad but overall it's in pretty good condition um, I did have to check comps because uh, some crash helmets are just worth nothing and um, it should be in 60 to 80 pound so not bad on a 12 pound investment a uh, pair of Air Jordans they're relatively new um, yeah 2019 should clean up quite nice nice bit of tread left on them and everything probably about 20 25 pound uh, we've got a pair of DC trainers here um, they look like they have been worn I'm gonna need a bit of a clean they're sort of suede but um, again should be about £20. Uh, I bought three pairs for £18, so quick maths, chat amongst yourselves. £6 each, there you go, if I can do maths me. Same with these vans, they're obviously going to need a bit of a clean because they're like a suede, but again, probably about 20 to use, but minimal use basically and then these ones which are uh, brand new still with tags uh, and they've got the spare laces and everything in them uh, probably push for about 30 for them ones so what are we have 20 40 70 quid from 18 pound not too bad uh, these ones quite interesting I saw them and they just they look like something special uh, they're made by Supra um, brand I've never heard of but yeah they should be about 35 to 40 pound again they look brand new never worn uh, we gave them a cheeky offer of nine pound right at the end because that was literally all the money we had Panasonic TV VCR remote picked it up uh, three quid they're usually about 12 to 15 but um, usually I'll, I'll try and keep them and to see if I get like a video machine or something. A uh, pair of just interesting shorts, Burbeck shorts. I don't know if they're custom or what. They look quite cool, different, wooden button. I say no idea what they're worth. Um, only paid two pound for them. So play it safe, they could be worth 15, but in, they could be worth 30. Unlikely, but uh, right next we got a uh, Kodak Insta camera um, it's still got a film in it so I'm kind of hoping that it's not all been used up and I can stick some batteries in it and actually test it but it also comes in its own carry case as well which is nice and then oh what's in here is there pictures in here I can see what's in here what's in here what's in here let me get in oh, oh. oh the original instruction manuals oh that's cool but um what did i pay for that 12 maybe can't remember um again don't know what it's worth the last time i sold a similar one to this it was about 25 30 quid i i'd kind of hope there's more in that but I don't know. Uh, complete with a Rio can. <laughs> a pair of Footjoy uh, golf shoes. They need some new laces, they need cleaning up, they need some new studs. I uh, paid £5 for them. Um, they're a good size, size 10. I'm hoping once I clean them up and remove some of these creases and stuff, I should be able to get 30 to 40 for them. Uh, right, we've got a. Uh, an old um, 
voice recorder. Like really old this one, this one's got to be 80s easily. Uh, paid five pound for it, hopefully um, it still works, but you know with older tech you never really know. But if it does, it's probably about 25 pound. Same goes with this one. Um, slightly more newer one, this is probably 90s. Um, it should be an easy 17, 18 quid for that one. Uh, I have no idea where the back of that's gone. It was definitely on there when I checked it, because I powered it on. Hopefully it's in the bag, in the trolley somewhere. Uh, I mainly bought this for my little girl. Um, I gave her my Xbox 360, and it had one of the really, really fancy, expensive controllers, and she's now got idle sway in it, so I literally leave it in the when she plays Minecraft, the character just sways across the map. So I'm hoping this hasn't got idle sway and she can have that. Um, so yeah, that was basically just all for her. It was, but if I was to sell it, it's probably not much more than I paid for. I think I paid 15, probably about 20, 25 quid. Uh, I need to get some kettle plugs or a kettle plug at the very least. But we've got three backwards compatible PS3s. Um, I think even untested they sell relatively well, but if it works, just a console only, um, I think is about £60 a console. Maybe more, I, don't, I need to check, but yeah, there's three of them. But I think even if they're not working, you still get about 20, 20 to 30 for them. Ah. See, I told you that the back of the remote was there, the controller. Now we just got to hope that the um, video machine controller is there, which I don't think it is. I think it has fallen out. So if anybody's watching this video and finds a Sony remote on the floor, it's mine. And the third backwards compatible PS3. Nice pickup of the day. If you don't know, you should know. Panasonic DMR EZ47. Um, all these DMRs, even the DVD ones, have some good value in them. But you want the uh, the video DVD combo because they record video on the DVD as well as having free view and everything. Even if they don't work, you still get about seventy pound for them. If they do work, one hundred and fifty, one hundred and eighty, if you're lucky. That's everything I got today. I only bought about one hundred and twenty odd pound with me, um, and if the Panasonic player works, that's all my money back. The rest of it's just profit. So, yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, give me a thumbs up if you did. Make sure you subscribe down below, and I'll catch you in the next one. See you later.